Hello, welcome to CI Chat. I'm Betty Burke. I'm here with Ariel Eber, who is a CI advocate from the Supply Chain Group in Finance. Welcome. Thank you. Tell us a little bit about you, your role, your time with U.S. Cellular, and a fun thing. Of course. So I've been with U.S. Cellular for just over two years, and I love it here since, since joining the team. I'm in procurement, and it's been a wonderful learning experience, learning about CI, becoming a CI advocate. Um, and then something fun about me is that I have played sports um, competitively on six out of seven of the continents. Wow, that does not sound fun. That sounds like way too much work to me. <laughs> Hard work, but fun. <laughs> Today we're going to talk about five whys, which is a tool in the plan phase of the CI model. I know it's one of your favorites. So talk a little bit about what five whys could be used for. Sure. So the five whys is a great tool that can be used in the planning phase, like you said, for simple to moderate size problems or issues, and it's used to really drill down to, to that root cause. So why five whys? Why not three or four? It's a great question. So they found that over time, five is, is uh, an optimal number to get to that root cause, where sometimes with three or four, it may not be enough. And uh, there are, are other times where you may need to ask a few more whys to get down to that root cause. Sounds like it would be easy to use. Can you give us an example? Sure. So one of the examples, um, a great example that I have is, why does my dog keep waking me up at night? And so that first why would be, because he leaves my son's bed to get into my bed. Why? And that's because he gets into bed with my son. He starts off the night in bed with my son. Well, why? Because he likes my son's blankets. And again, another why is, because he wants to be covered up with a blanket. Why does he want to be covered up with the blanket? Because he's cold. So you would think, okay, we're getting, we're getting close. Mm -hmm. And then that last why would be is my son kicks the blankets off of the bed so he gets into bed with me. The root cause of it, like I said, is because he's cold, and the solution would be to put a sweater on him. That would be cute. A dog <laughs> in a sweater. That would be very cute. Yes. And... Stemming out from that, too, with my son is, well, why does my son kick the blankets off of the bed? And we could create a whole other five whys around why my son kicks the blankets off of the bed. And as we start to, to ask the questions why, one of the, the answers to one of those whys might be because I let him have three blankets on the bed because he likes cars, frozen, and 101 Dalmatians. So as we start to drill down with those whys with my son, it's because he's too hot, so he kicks all of his blankets off of the bed. Solution to that would be to not let him sleep with three blankets on the bed. He can have three blankets, maybe not all at once, though. That's right. Rotate them. Exactly. Well, thank you for that explanation and the example. See you next time on CI Chat.